It seems a legend about Rassilon is true. You must make a full statement to the High Council. Oh, must I? It can form part of your inaugural address. My what? Doctor, you have evaded your responsibilities for far too long. The disqualification of President Barusa leaves a gap at the very summit of the Time Lord hierarchy. There is only one who can take this place. Yet again, it is my duty and my pleasure to inform you that the full council has exercised its emergency powers to appoint you to the position of president, to take office immediately. Very well, Chancellor Flager. You will return to Gallifrey immediately and summon the High Council. You have full deputy powers until I return. I shall travel in my TARDIS. Oh, but don't... You will address me by my proper title. I am president, am I not? You will obey my commands into the TARDIS. You will escort Chancellor Flavia back to her duties. Doctor, wait! Hold tight. It'll soon be goodbye, then. Will it? Well, you're off to Gallifrey to be president. I suppose your Time Lord subjects will find a TARDIS that really works and get us both home. Who said anything about Gallifrey? You told Chancellor Fife. I told her she had full powers until I return. You're not going back. You know, sometimes, Tegan, you take my breath away. <laughs> uh, won't the Time Lords be very angry? Furious. You mean you're deliberately choosing to go on the run from your own people in a rackety old TARDIS? Why not? After all, that's how it all started.